A jackhammer is a type of pneumatic tool, and it's used to drive steel or metal fasteners into concrete. These tools are ideal for installing fences, posts, or any other type of metal post into the ground. Although you can buy a jackhammer just about anywhere, this article will take a look at the best jackhammers on the market. If you want to see the price and find out more information about these products, you can check out the links in the description below. And make sure you like the video, subscribe our channel, and hit the bell icon for future updates. Without further ado, let's get started with the list. Starting our list with number 5, we have the TR Industrial TR89305. The TR Industrial TR89305 electric jackhammer delivers on the promise of its name. With 60 joules of impact energy and 1800 BPM, the TR89305 is one of the most potent electric jackhammers we've tested, beating out the DeWalt DC Cade 225 and Bosch HEA's 18 EVL and scoring an impressive 2.2 on the 1 to 10 impact strength scale. The higher the number, the more complex the hammer and the greater the demolition force. The TR89305's top speed of 1800 BPM, about 1550 blows per minute, is also one of the highest we measured. And unlike the Bosch and DeWalt, which also had 60 joules, the TR89305 has a built-in carry handle that's both easier to carry around and easier to use. That extra handle length also comes in handy on longer jobs, whether you're demolishing or remodeling. The TR89305 has all-metal construction for heavy-duty applications, and it comes with a 20-feet extension cord, a double-insulated plug, and thermal overload protection. And while the TR89305 isn't as bright as many electric jackhammers we tested, it's plenty bright for demolishing drywall and plaster. It's also pretty quiet, and its 3.7 pounds weight feels lighter. The only issue we had with the TR89305 was that it produced mildly inconsistent results, with the most powerful results coming from hitting hard and repeatedly at the end of the cord. But overall, the TR89305 delivers on its name, and it's one of the most powerful electric jackhammers out there. At number 4, Mahforn 3500 Watt. The Mahforn electric demolition hammer is powerful and durable, and is the ideal choice for making holes and removing bricks. The electric hammer comes with a flat chisel and a chisel point. We use it frequently to fit spalling pipes, making the task much easier. It cuts through brick walls, concrete, and stone easily. The electric hammer has a rubber grip which reduces vibration. It performs well when used on hard surfaces. The motor is very powerful, making the electric hammer efficient at demolition work. The electric hammer is easy to set up and very easy to use. It has a noiseless motor, and it is very comfortable to carry. The electric chisel breaker is built to last an extended period. The electric chisel breaker is lightweight, making it easy to carry and suitable for outdoor use. The rubber cover protects the electric chisel breaker from getting dirty. The electric chisel breaker has accessories included in the box. The electric chisel breaker is sufficient for small and medium jobs. However, bigger jobs may need a more powerful demolition hammer. The electric chisel breaker is 240 volts, 3 phases and 3, 5 amps. The electric chisel breaker comes with a product made of high-quality, anti-impact material. Number 3. We have the Extreme Power US. This heavy-duty electric demolition jackhammer has everything you need to get started, including a protective helmet. It's also very straightforward to use, and you can adjust the positions on the drill head and handle to suit your needs. This jackhammer is powerful enough to get the job done if you need to break up concrete or asphalt. The 16-inch chisel bit makes it easy to get deep into concrete, and the included 16-inch flat chisel is perfect for breaking up large pieces. The 2.2-pound weight feels good and lets you hold the power trigger with little effort, so you're less likely to fatigue your hands before chipping away at the concrete. The only drawback was that the 16-inch bullpoint chisel was too long for our liking, so we had to break off the end of the bit. If it's easy enough, but you'll probably have to spread your fingers apart a bit to manage the drill head. Still, it's not a huge deal, and it's easy enough to swap bits if you'd instead use a 15-inch bullpoint chisel or a shorter flat chisel. Overall, this is an excellent jackhammer for demolishing concrete. At number 2, Vever Demolition. This jackhammer has no problem demolishing the concrete and can easily chip away at blocks, brick, tile, and stucco. It's a heavy, powerful electric drill with a generous 2-inch chuck, and when paired with the four chisels in case, it's capable of tackling various jobs. 
The powerful 2200-watt motor charges quickly, producing enough torque to knock down several concrete blocks in a row. The vibration can be felt through the handle, but it's comfortable enough to use for extended periods. The 360-degree rotating handle allows you to maneuver the jackhammer in a broader range of positions than the competitors we tested. The head is compact enough to fit in tight places, and the vibration-reducing handle makes it comfortable for extended periods. The four chisels in case make this jackhammer a general-purpose tool for most jobs, though it's not the most powerful jackhammer we tested and was disappointingly slow at chipping through soft concrete. While this jackhammer has the best combination of features for general-purpose demolition work, its powerful motor and range of accessories make it an ideal choice for professional demolition contractors. And finally, the number one of our list, Bosch 11335K. The Bosch 11335K is a jackhammer pack that's an all-around champ. It delivers a ton of power in a small package enough to require very little exertion. And while it's not as versatile as the Milwaukee's 2452, it does have the Bosch's advantage in vibration control and performance. The inline design allows operators to use the tool in upright or inverted mode. The Bosch's inline allows for easier and quicker bit changes, and the adjustable auxiliary handle allows operators to adjust their positioning for better control and better precision easily. The handle also allows the tool to be used in an angled horizontal or vertical terminal. Its inline design and the ability to adjust rotation and placement help the 11335K, or the 1 and 1 8 inch model, deliver impressive performance, while its vibration control makes for more comfortable, less fatiguing use. The Bosch auxiliary handle, however, has a fairly limited range of motion. It can only be adjusted up to 90 degree, and up and down only 10 degree. The Milwaukee 2452 can be adjusted much more precisely. But when it comes to overall power, the Bosch 11335K is miles ahead. As always, you will find all the links of these products in the description below. Thanks for watching this video. If you found this video helpful, then like and share this video. Also, don't forget to subscribe our channel for more amazing videos like this.